A top Vatican diplomat is meeting with world leaders this week at the United Nations General Assembly. Archbishop Paul Gallagher is representing the Holy Father. Our correspondent, Wyatt Goolsby, has been covering the UN this week. He just returned from New York City. Good evening, Wyatt. Good evening, Lauren. Nice to be back here in Washington. Archbishop Gallagher is weighing in on some of the biggest global challenges, migration, nuclear weapons, and even the death penalty. And with all these issues, the dignity of the human person is the common thread. Archbishop Gallagher is the Holy See Secretary for Relations with States. He regularly attends the UN General Assembly and meetings on the sidelines while in the Big Apple. During one, the Archbishop said the Holy See supports both the UN and an increasing number of countries who are calling for the end of the death penalty. In addition, he's also commending countries who are raising awareness of the plight of migrants and refugees. While in New York, I asked the Pope's personal representative to the UN, Archbishop Bernadito Alza, why it's so important the Holy See maintain a presence at the United Nations. There are so many really very uh, fundamental interests which are common uh, between the United Nations and uh, all those you could find at the social doctrine or the social teaching of the church, especially, I mean, questions like uh, development, like peace, uh, like fundamental human rights, human rights in general. Archbishop Alza tells me this is the reason why the Holy See supports the UN's Global Compact for Migration. That document is the first ever international agreement on a common approach to migration in all its dimensions. Archbishop Gallagher emphasized this week that challenges like migration can't be solved without help from everyone. It's not just state and local governments, but every individual as well. He says the church teaches it's a shared responsibility to help those greatest in need. Lauren? Why migration is one of the issues that Pope Francis talks about a lot, and I understand that Archbishop Gallagher also brought up Pope Francis's name. What did he say? He did. So the Pope really thinks about this in terms of solidarity. That's his big key word in thinking about all this. So the, it's the idea not only to welcome the stranger, but it's also to protect them and to look to integrate them in society. So, Lauren, it's more of an all-encompassing thing. Last year when I interviewed Archbishop Gallagher, he talked a lot about a world without nuclear weapons. Is that something he mentioned this time as well? He did, and the, it, there's been a question of whether or not that's even possible. And I think the Holy See does believe it's possible. Gallagher says the world is not safer with nuclear weapons. It's more dangerous, period. He also says eliminating nuclear weapons is a moral imperative. The Vatican realizes it won't happen overnight either, but they say countries need to move in the direction of disarming nuclear weapons and facilities. Lauren? Wyatt, thank you so much. Good to have you back. Thanks, Lord.